Hi everyone, I'm Alien Square and welcome to the double draw strategy for football games. Um, some of you are already familiar with this strategy. This is uh, betting on draws. So uh, the most you need to do is pick some teams and bet that those teams will draw eventually. I will have three things for this presentation. Uh, the first thing is uh, the list with the games in Italy, as an example, the last uh, five games for each uh, team. The second thing is the file that I made for calculating uh, the bets that you need to put for uh, the teams that you follow. And the third thing is the presentation itself. So this is called double draws and uh, I will come to um, a short description of this strategy. What you need to do is uh, pick a team that is uh, you or you consider that is more likely to make a draw in the next games. Bet on the draw you will get uh, from 3.2 to maybe 4 or 5 the ads for that team. In case you lose the bet, you need to bet again on the next game and on the next game until you eventually will win. So this is the strategy. Um, I will take one example. If you pick Lazio, in this case, you will see that Lazio had a win 4-0 against Tempoli, which is a loss to you. Uh, it will have a loss uh, with Juventus which is also a loss to you and uh, on the third match it will have a draw against Kievo which is a win for you and you can go uh, to pick another team or pick Lazio again up to you um, why this is powerful maybe you are familiar with this strategy or maybe you thought about this strategy in your mind um, what if we bet on the same team over and over uh, on each game until it makes a draw? Um, this is profitable because you need to increase the stake so that you cover your previous investments. Um, meaning that uh, you bet 2 euros for a team, didn't make a draw, you will bet 3 euros on the next game you'll bet 4 euros and so on so that it will uh, bring back your investment and uh, also um, make your profit what is not good and this is why uh, does it say the best way to get you a profit in most of the websites it will not show you the best way because it will say that you need to increase the stake with some amount they don't calculate that. So what I did, I calculated and I put two rules um, for this strategy. The first rule is cover the losses and ensure the profit is constant. And this is why I calculated the bet so that the profit is constant. You not you don't need to increase the bet too much because it will end up increasing the investment too much. And in case the team will not make a draw, then you you don't have the chance to cover more games uh, what is important is that you cover um, uh, sufficient games with the money that you have so that the investment is bring back to you and this is the second rule and the most important you need to cover your losses you don't need to 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 lose money on this strategy because it is very risky um, both these rules are covered in the file that I show to you at the start of the presentation and coming back to the file this is the file you can fill up only the cells that are yellow or um, this color so say you pick up a team uh, from first league Italy I will pick Palermo writing the name Palermo just to, um, to to have this team 
Um, okay, looking at the last games, uh, two wins against Udinese and Genoa and uh, a loss against Parma. So what I'll do is to, to put these things, uh, say we, we bet on each of these games. Uh, what is um, the only bet that you can put on this file is the minimum bet that you, you can put for this team. I recommend it to, to be 2 euros if possible. So I will put 2 euros. The odds generally are between 3 to 3.3 to 4 maybe. So I will put 3.4, 3.5, 3.3. Uh, here it needs to be N and I will explain you in just a bit and here is the uh, result that Palermo had each game a win, a win and a loss okay which makes the profit uh, to be zero uh, here you need to put the profit that you want uh, to have with this strategy so meaning for each game the bet that you put will ensure you to have this profit uh, say through euros Okay, so having a profit of 3 euros, you will need to, to have these bets, considering these odds that you get, and considering the uh, previous investment. Meaning that uh, if uh, on the, after the first two games the investment was 4 euros, and you get these odds from the bookmaker, then this calculates against the investment, against the odds, and against the bet, and will mean that you need to put 3.04 euros to have the, this investment. Okay, and you'll just see in just a bit, say you have 2.5 with the next game. This is again N, and this is finally a draw. Okay, you see that it calculates the 3 euro profit from the investment that you had so far together with this bet and it gives you 3 euro so this is what's uh, good with the file you don't need to um, to think too much uh, how much you should bet you don't have the chance to increase it too much uh, because it's very important to stay on the lowest limit you can and you will see in just a moment um, say you didn't uh, win you have a loss another loss another loss another loss okay uh, this is 3.3 3 and 3.5 3.4 okay uh, here it's n sorry n and this is uh, the total investment you had after um, uh, seven games so is it much yeah, this is up to you to consider uh, for each of these games it, it happens to be a draw you will have three euros you can change it you can use the strategy with five euros and you just see that the investment after uh, 7 games is uh, 37 euros and if you put to have a 5 euro profit the investor investment will be bigger will be 51 okay so this is up to you if you put more profit uh, of course you can't cover so many games but you have another option you can put 5 euro profit and uh, say after the uh, 4 games you will decide that you don't need to risk anymore and you just want to to have the investment back without any profit meaning that um, after three games you put Y instead of N Y Y Y and the Excel will know that you want zero profit meaning that you risk for five euro profit just on the first three games after uh, starting with the fourth game 
the profit uh, will be zero and for you just to cover the investment okay assuming this is a draw you can see that the profit is zero it calculates a bet so that the profit it, it will be zero okay but this is a loss and you have the draw here okay isn't it wonderful okay um, um, assuming this is a uh, uh, in progress game you can put here the uh, odds if you want to see how much you should bet for the next game 3.5 this is just uh, this is just for your information okay you have a, a bet in progress you have already the odds for the next game and you see if uh, assuming this bet will be lost this is the next bet that you should put against these ads okay this is very good for you to anticipate and to to see the investment which is the same as here and the next bet so assuming this is a loss we will copy 3.5 which we have here we'll copy in this file and this will calculate the next bet okay it will do uh, for the next bet over and over until you need it okay but we assume this is a draw so we have zero profit we have the investment back and hopefully you would have money from other teams because you see that uh, palermo manages actually to to bring money uh, on the fourth game so meaning if we go with the four games we would have uh, without this without this so this is a draw but we didn't want to to risk too much and we don't have a profit because we put y here if we would have selected n going back to what i said it will increase the bet it will increase the investment but we will have some profit and we put y here because starting with the next game the profit will be zero okay so at a point you will need to decide going with the higher profit and then put y and bring the profit to zero just to to take over the investment or um, going with three euro profit which will make the investment much smaller 11 euros with this game but we already covered and have a profit in 3 euros so this is um, in short this file what it does um, you will see that um, uh, most of the teams if you take them from the middle of the table which I recommend to do so because um, uh, say the first five teams will fight for a new European Cup the last five teams will fight for avoiding retrogradation and you can see that there are no draws they were likely uh, to to risk for a win there are no draws no draws uh, and taking from the middle of the table you'll have draws for every team except Genoa in this case which you need to cover more than five games so you need to to have a loss and then a loss again and then go with the Y just to cover the investment and you can take money from other teams if you go to five euros um, rate you'll have for this rows 5 10 15 euros only from this team in uh, five games which is quite good I, I must say okay uh, this is the file um, hope this is a uh, very intuitive for you to use if you want and going back to the presentation so I put the two rules which I explained with a n for this for having a profit constant with a y for having the profit zero and just take over uh, take back the investment 
going to the good and bad um, the good is that you can follow this strategy for multiple teams you can see that you can put use this file for every of these teams starting with the sixth one until the 15th uh, place so you can put a file for every of these teams um, this ensures you the same profit even it's a draw on the first it isn't uh, even it's a draw on the first match even you lose some games and then you get a draw which is uh, what I explained the profit is still 3 euros or how much you want to be um, a team should eventually draw right this team in, in, in my example ways you know should eventually draw it had uh, five games and it should draw in the next games this is the assumption um, the more games it had uh, without a draw the more uh, it should draw the next games this is my my assumption the bad thing is that maybe a long period of time until a draw uh, you may have for these teams a draw in the first game you don't need to wait too much you just bet and get the, uh, the profit you will have a draw on the second game which means that uh, you need to, to wait until the second week because uh, usually a team plays one game at uh, per week so you need to, to wait two weeks to, to get a profit for this team you will need to wait more than a month so if i take one game uh, on each week it will be five weeks without a draw so you have the investment blocked you have this money blocked here okay you have 15 euros which will be blocked on on this team um you need to pick teams correctly as you seen um, you need to have a strategy for picking the teams don't pick the first teams um, as I said don't pick the last teams in the table but even if you pick the teams from the middle of the table you can find one example like this where it doesn't draw so this is a bad thing because uh, you need to pick the teams correctly but in not on, in all the cases they will uh, have a draw um, going further to the end of my presentation if you have any feedback or comments please feel free to put them on YouTube or contact me at this uh, alien square 3 at gmail.com um, your suggestions and ideas are appreciated and of course if you like and share the video with this presentation and want to have this file please uh, email me and I will give it to you for free thank you and hope you enjoy it uh, good luck with your bets <laughs>